the star-studded opening of the Kevesio Socialite Abidiva's Adam and Eve Lingerie Center, broadcasters Nanaba Anamwa, Jifa Gray, and AJ Sapon, movie stars Bibi Bright and Nanama McBrown, politician and deputy CEO of Maslock, Sewa Akutu, were among the many who turned up at the launch. Abidiva owns Adam and Eve. You know, I, oh, I opened my Abidiva wrap, I, I think about six months ago. And then one thing I realized was there was not enough lingeries in Ghana, especially for class size. So I decided to actually open this just for other women who <laughs> Actually, you bring sex dolls in. No, I'm not gonna. I'm not. I'm really not gonna deal with sex dolls. I'm not. <laughs> but what's special about a woman's lingerie? Nanama McBrown and Deputy Maslock CEO Sawakoto say the men pay attention to the cuts and brands. I have friends that will, will, will size you no matter the outlook of a so huni power ya of a so shed a shell. Madame Ruano is a rod rust now, no shell label. No. And they know, men of great knows what's up. Jonathan, let your mind, you know. <laughs> <laughs> and your mind, you know, uh, you know, you are you know it doesn't matter, say, what worry, and that's a whole champion. You really need to keep your underwear clean. I mean, re wear the right ones. I mean, they invoke. Yes, if you invoke, and the draws a cry, you invoke. I love to get my undies unique and fit and properly for every outfit. I mean, when you are in cover and slit, is what you, there is something to wear. When you are in a tight cloth, there is something to wear. And in as much as we fall between the, the youthful age and then the elderly, we always have to get the right undies yeah. for the right clothes. Sincerely, it's, it's women especially, we have a lot of hygiene problems and we need to keep ourselves clean. Bibi Bright and AJ Sapon also spoke about the Andy wearing culture of mainly Ghanaian females. I'm that type that I'll just go into a lingerie shop and just try what I, I can try on and buy. But when she told me she was about to open Adam and Eve, I was like, no, I need to take advantage and really know my size. Because it's very bad. Sometimes my husband, oh sorry, my, my fiance would want to buy me something, especially if he sees something he wants to buy and he goes like, I've been outside today and now I'm stuck. So I realized I really take advantage of this place and just get to know my size. And as for the parties, they know my size very well. So that we, we have a good collection here. Yeah. I think I'll wear this tonight. Tonight? Why is something happening tonight? Uh, Mexico. Okay. Perhaps it's Ghana, but if you uh, you go to various parts of the world, I mean, it's, it's easy and affordable and it comes in packs. So if you go to some place as um, High Street as Primark, you can get packs and packs of it easily. But in Ghana, it's not the case. In Ghana, you have to actually look for one one. People don't really buy, sell it in bulk or even in packs. So you have to consciously look for it. Um, Again, there's not been a lot of high-end um, or affordable in terms of uh, good quality stuff. So a lot of people go for the cheap, which is not bad in the least. But it's just that a lot of times it's not the quality that should be put on a human body. I mean, if you are wearing something that's been worn before by someone else, I mean, can you imagine the kind of things that get passed on to you?